Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to my channel, everyone! I'm the Global Cherry, and this is another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Before we begin, subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications. Let's do this! Why did Scrope ask us to come here? Visitor? Oh, there's another ghost with no head. I thought it was just headless Nick. Oh, ah. <laughs> oh oops. Ah, the name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest? And I'll show you where to find the pages. The Forbidden Forest, you say? Well, I heard the Forbidden Forest was off limits, but you know what? YOLO, let's do it. Hello there! Let me pet you. It's time to attend defense against the dark arts during the day. Let class begin. Are we gonna learn Expelliarmus today? Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Yes! Close attention. Expelliarmus! Yes! Okay, it's time to go to the Forbidden Forest now. Who's with me? We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well, I am a Slytherin after now, all. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Yeah. Keep your eyes open for a bird bath. Let's travel together. A level 20! I think it's better to run past this forest. I think I'm too under level for this. Intramuros. Whoa. Aren't you a little far from home? Renra Crap. knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. But uh... Whoa. Take that! I never knew Renrock's loyalist warriors would be coming here. Incendio! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Maybe also! I'll get you for this! Ah! Ah! Oh, I have the worst fear of spiders. Ooh, Accio! Ew! How am I gonna be a dark wizard if I'm scared of spiders? Actually, no, even dark wizards are scared of spiders. Yee! Incendio! <laughs> oh, die, please! Die! 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 Please die! <laughs> is that you? It's really on What kind of spiders are these? Oh, oh no! It's on you! Take that! Oh, no! No! Why is there more of you? Maybe these were what beheaded Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Maybe we can discover some secrets? Oh! Oh, great! Avada Kiwi! Looks like more of them are coming. Whoa! Is that a pen sea of protector? Jesus! Expelliarmus! Expelliarmus! Huh! Whoa! Whoa! Come on, show me what you got! Expelliarmus! Levioso! Incendio! Oh look, there's more of you! Yeah! Let's go! Can it be? Percival Rackham? We can talk to him? We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. The one we found in the restricted section. I'll bring the book here. I need to master the dark arts because I'm trying to become the darkest wizard of all time. I want to go to flying class. Let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those all right, I'm a fast learner. Step up to your broom. Say up firmly and clearly. 
Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. Up! Up! Up, you stupid rat of school broom! Up. Up! One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Ooh, got it. We don't want to start a day like Neville Longbottom. And We're doing it. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Oh, well done. Have a moment? Yes, I do. I'm Everett Clopton. I'm Cherry. I'm suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class. Yes, I am. I like the sound of that. I can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. This looks and so beautiful. Elderly. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Indeed it is. And a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. I love this tour. Oh, we almost ran into the hippogriff. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Oh man, I really wanted to fly for longer. Let's hurry back. hand in our brooms. Let's dismount. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Hi, Madame Kagawa. Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not mm. following my instructions. Come on. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. I have no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. Let's look for our friend Sebastian. He's waiting for us. Jeez, someone decided to choose violence today. Oh, you poor thing. Reparo. Nothing can repair his dignity anymore. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. You're a true friend. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Let's talk somewhere we can else. We'll talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. The Undercroft? Let's enter the secret room. There's a secret room. passage just here. I love secret passages. The Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Did you say forbidden spells? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Yay! Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. That's ridiculous. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. Confringo! Well done. Let's check back with Sebastian. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. I would have <laughs> paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day... There's something about that spell that's addictive. I'm ready for more spells like this. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more Please teach me. I've been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And Yay. remember, keep this place between us. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. Uh-oh. You there? I can hear you. Oh, hello, Ominous. I was just heading to our common room. I've Hi. Voice. You're the new fifth year. Did you just yes. call me Undercroft? 
How did you get in there? I stumbled upon it. That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and suddenly found myself in a strange passage. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Jeez, Ominous, Sebastian calm down. I told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. Sebastian. Why can't we all be friends? It's all about this. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? I need one to get around Hogwarts. Okay, let's get ourselves a U Weaver broom. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. Like you what? You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Sounds worth a try, Mr. Weeks. Can't you haven't seen my skills. in flying class with Clopton. You sound jealous. I've seen someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. Oh for yeah? For some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You can't Perhaps. passes for Slytherin these days. Pfft, ragged old hats dropping at standards. <sighs> Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I only one, one way to find out. In this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin okay. versus Slytherin. Whoa! This is so cool! Oh. Whoa! Oh, success! Yes! Oh crap. Made it. Yes. Woo. Woo. Brilliant. No, Imelda. Oh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Oh. Mm. You won. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my we'll see. Is something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. What if I just want your captain position? I don't want your respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. Let's go meet with Professor Weasley. Woo! I can't wait to get introduced to the room of requirement. Professor Weasley? <sighs> Somewhere away from prying eyes. Where did she go? Whoa, look at that door. Is this the room of requirement? Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. I didn't find it. Shall we? Evanesco! I wonder what that house elf is. This isn't as precarious as it looks. Perhaps not. Otherwise, why would Professor Weasley take us here? What? I'm not an intruder. 
That's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! <laughs> oh my, that can't be done. It's so pretty! The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Okay, let's focus. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Mm-hmm. Oh, what did we create? Yo! This is some sight to see. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Welcome to my Slytherin Room of Requirement. What type of ambiance should we go for? A cool moonlit ambiance sounds perfect. I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Oh, mm, sounds perfect. Whoa! Look at the room now. It does look like it's being mm. lit by the moon. Quite a difference. Let's make ourselves a Wiccan World potion. And we got it! So much happened while you were away. I received a flurry of messages from Professor Black's house elf, Scrope. Scrope sent you messages? Yes, I yes he did. It was odd too. He asked me to meet him and then told me to take the toast. Why would you want to take toast? To a cave under the lake. And that's where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student, student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because we did. Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was Let's find the room. That. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Let's put the book on there. It's like it created a magical pool of stars. A map. There's Hogsmeade. And over here, the it is a map. forest. And of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. What does this mean? Well, so the trials haven't even started yet. The power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. Time is we luxury. We waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, of course I the do. the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate a dozen them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More I could check. However, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalus. Petrificus Totalus. Totalus. These loyalists are really oblivious, aren't they? Petrificus Totalus. Totalus. Someone there. Search the tower and surrounding areas. Something to do with names. 
What names? And why here? Ranrock is looking for names. How odd. Uh-oh. I will draw blood. Spells won't save you there. Whoa! Jeez! Feel the ancient magic. Expelliarmus! Confringo! Lady also! Whoa! Whoa! No! Labioso! Oh. Oh. Alright! Confringo! Oh, this is a powerful spell! Why, thank you, Sebastian, for teaching me this! Cherry, why are you sipping 10 day old coffee? Downstairs, Let's move forward. Near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Commanded to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. Here it is Percival Rackham's first trial. Portal time! Something must be different. Oh, I see where this is going. Like Expelliarmus! Confringo! Yeah! We didn't give them enough time to think. What is that? Wait, was this the pensive guardian we saw before? I'm barely doing any damage to this thing. Let's use ancient magic on it. Whew. Let's whittle down on his health. It only has half left. Good, good, good. Is he regenerating? Let's hope not. It has two attacks now. That's new. Why does he have two attacks? Woo! Confringo. Okay, let's attack it. Oh, it's summoning a fireball like a Super Saiyan. Confringo. Boss is a joke. And let's finish him off. Oh, that's so cool. The pensive memories are coming in the form of a teardrop. What kind of memories are we going to see? Father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. She's gonna turn evil, isn't she? Ago, but the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It's fallen Hogwarts. I wasn't expecting the seasons change. And I'm waking up in my Slytherin common room. Come on then, what you got? It's Why a... is it moving? What, I bet- Your bag, it's wriggling. What you got in there? Not rat sire. No, it's a Niffler. What do I want with a Niffler? Oh. Oh, it's so cute. Stole from me, he did. He was robbed by a Niffler. I, that's what I'm saying. He, he's a natural, <laughs> worth his weight in galleons. Go on then, show him to me. Uh, uh I must. You're have... wasting my time. Ow! No, I would he's never waste your, your little rat. He's scratch me. Your oh, poacher can't even keep hold oh, of Come on, where rat. are you? If I he's ever catch a rat. rat, it's dead. You hear me? Dead. Uh, Get out of he's here. He's not a rat. Amateur. Are these really dark wizards? That is all for today. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications, especially if you want another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Thank you for watching, and that's all.